I could have been a president, could have been a doctor, could have been Ronaldo, I could have played soccer, could have had a job at the mall who could never ever ball, but it wasn't me, it wasn't my The girls soccer season and soccer team are going to be very different than last year. The girls are losing approximately 11 players, and that's a, almost the whole squad entirely. The girls are going to face a lot of difficulties, but it seems like the players and coach, coaching staff are aware of this and are prepared. Coach Strauss had this to say. Um, <laughs> what do you think on the girls soccer team and how they'll do this season compared to last? Well, this year we'll have a, a number of different challenges, mainly because we lost so many players and the team the soccer program, the girls' soccer program has, hasn't lost a league game in four years. However, this year we got a lot of, a lot of young new players, um, and it'll be a bit more challenging to uh, continue their record. So, hopefully, I think we'll be okay. I think we'll still be in the hunt for the league championship, but we may not have the same kind of success we've had in the past. Strauss believes that the girls can continue doing well, and that with the young players that are recruited, um, they will prosper and win the EMAC title again. Another player, or actually a player from the team, Nicole Perez, when asked about her ideas of the girls' soccer season, she had this to say. <clears throat> um, what are your thoughts on the girls' soccer season and how they'll do with the loss of almost 11 players? Um, it's it's going to be a hard... It's, I think we're going to start off pretty rough. But we're going to get way better throughout the season. With, I mean, we only have like less than 10 returning varsity players. But with the new players we have now, I think we're going to do way better. Do you think you'll win the league championship again? 